it's the death of the son. The son is the giver of life. And now that he's born again, let's let's continue and follow in his footsteps until he dies again. I'm Fox 13 Utah's meteorologist, Chris Nunley. Today was a celestial celebration for millions around the world who viewed the total solar eclipse. Is that so. the moon? The occurrence of a solar eclipse is an exciting celebration amongst the Western culture, but solar eclipses hold a different meaning for many indigenous peoples. The state of Utah experienced 50 to 60% totality earlier this afternoon, but over my tribal grounds in southeastern Oklahoma, totality was experienced. Today's celestial event provides a unique opportunity to shine light on important cultural differences, beliefs, and practices of the solar eclipse. Choctaw oral stories have it that mischievous, hungry black squirrels saw the sun and began to nibble on it. As the squirrels ate away at the sun, it grew dark outside. The darkness was concerning for the Choctaws and unrest grew because the sun is everything in our culture. Sun is the creator. Sun is life. It keeps the crops growing and the water falling from the sky. In an effort to divert the squirrels from the sun, the Choctaw people found a creative solution to rid the sun of the black squirrels. They got very excited. The women and children started coming out and creating this huge amount of noise because they wanted to scare Funny Lissa away. They come out and start throwing sticks at Funny Lissa to scare him away. This worked, and the sun slowly came back to full brightness, leading to mass celebrations. Solar eclipses are now viewed as a celebratory time, and this tradition is still practiced by some on the Choctaw Nation. The celebration of a solar eclipse isn't the same belief amongst all indigenous peoples. For some tribes, it is a time of change, a ceremonial time, a natural occurrence to respect and not be outside. Today's solar eclipse for the Navajo people was regarded as a time of reverence and respect as it is believed to contribute to an individual's spirit balance during the significant celestial event. Given the sun's symbolic importance as a source of life and the rebirth of the sun after the moon eclipses it, today's solar eclipse has a sacred significance in which pausing for reflection is practiced during the transition from death to birth of the sun. We sit inside as Navajos and reflect on ourselves. We don't eat, we don't drink, we don't uh, laugh. That's what we do as Navajo is we stay inside, we reflect, we persevere, we sit reverently, and then after it's done, we go outside with corn pawn, or is what we call khadadin, and we do a blessing, and it's, it's almost like a, a baby was born again, the blessing that we give. The differing beliefs surrounding the solar eclipse are all important, and it's vital that we continue to tell those stories and practice those traditions so those beliefs aren't lost to history. We can all reflect and agree on the importance of the sun and the earth. In Salt Lake County, I'm Fox 13 Utah's meteorologist, Chris Nunley.